Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be reviewing a generator V adapter cord. I get so many questions about this cord that I decided to do a review on all the cords that I've been using. That's where I get most of my adapters from is Park World. They're sponsoring this video, so we're going to be taking a look at most of their adapters to help you guys out. This is a generator V adapter cord, meaning that it goes to 50 amp plug to your RV and it comes down to two 15 amp plug. So you could parallel two generators using this adapter. You can actually use this as your parallel kit. The difference between this and the parallel kit is that when you use a parallel kit, both generators ramp up and down at the same time. This one will allow your generators to run individually. So we're gonna use two 2,500 watt inverter generators. This allows you to um, save fuel and use this instead of a parallel kit. Another thing this is very useful for, if you guys do any kind of um, boondocking and you go to your family house and you wanna use their, uh, their plugs, instead of running your entire RV on one extension cord, you can actually go to someone's house, plug into two different outlets. So instead of just running on one extension cord, you can actually have two extension cords coming to your RV. So you have 20 amps over here, 20 amps over here, going to your 50 amp RV. So this is real helpful when it comes to boondocking. You pull up to your family house. The only thing you have to make sure is to plug into two different circuits. So I'll plug this one into one plug. And I'll plug this one into another plug. Usually people have two, three plugs outside. You just find two different plugs that's on two different circuits and utilize it that way. You won't get a full 50 amp to your RV, but it's a lot better than running on one, getting only, um, getting only 20 or 15 amps. Now you get two extension cord running on. So we're going to try this on the generators and see what we get. All right, guys. So let's go over this real quick. It's a generator V adapter cord. So you have 15 amp times two to 50 amp. Household regular is the 5-15P male two and the RV 50A14-50R female. So that's what goes to your RV. All right, so this is what you have. Two 5-15P and one 14-50R. All right, let's hook it up to the RV and see uh, what we can do with this, okay? I'll put the link in the description to Park World's uh, website so you can get this if you want. Okay guys, I'm gonna be using two 2500 watt generators. I'm gonna come over here. I'll plug one here. So one thing you wanna make sure when you're using this is make sure both generators are plugged in at all times and go ahead and start your generator before you connect always and disconnect your generator before you shut off all right so we're gonna keep it right here so they're both running on eco mode let's go ahead and plug in the rv Okay guys, as you can see right away, this one's pulling 200, meaning the battery charger is getting pulling power from this generator. This one's pulling nothing. So let's get inside the RV, turn on some loads and see which one comes on. Okay guys, we're inside the RV. First thing to do, you're gonna turn on your refrigerator as usual. Refrigerator's on. So I'm going to show you this, the separation of the two generators. We're going to use the AC. All right. So I'm going to turn on the front AC first. So this one's connected to the front AC. It's pulling 1,200 watts. This one's pulling 200 watts. 0 0.22. All right, now let's turn on the other AC. Okay, got the back AC on. Okay, 
Now this one just start the uh, back AC. That one has the refrigerator and the AC. I guess this one just have the back AC. All right, let's turn the ACs off. Turn the refrigerator off. The fans just went off on the front AC. So I'm going to turn this one off. Let's see if this one comes on. Okay guys, so one thing I wanted to show you guys. So I have one generator off. This will not send power with just one generator running. If I have that one generator running and go inside, it won't send power. I actually have to have both generator running. With one generator running, no power goes to the RV. As soon as both generators are running, then you'll get power. But the good thing is, each generator is given power individually. So there's no need for both of them to run at the same RPM when you're just you getting power from one. If I shut one off, the AC will go off on the other one. Okay guys, quick video just showing you the generator V adapter cord. We will be doing more reviews on more generator adapter cords, so just stay tuned. And if you like this one, the link is down in the description, so if you want to buy it. Okay? Guys, thanks for watching this quick video on the Park World V generator adapter cord. Guys, thanks for watching. Have a great day.